Hi guys, today we're talking about some of the exciting new updates for the S-Play. First off, we've added an effects generator, which lets you create effects to send out to your fixtures without the need to record in from a separate console or a piece of software. This has been added as a queue type, so you can find it in your queue library when you go to edit your queues. In the rainbow effect, we can change the number of LEDs we're transmitting to, the offset or the number of LEDs skipped over, the type of LED, so RGB, RGBW and variations of these, and we can change BPM or beats per minute, which relates to how fast the pattern will scroll through. This is great for doing basic patterns and testing since you can set these up in the S-Play without the need to bring in an extra laptop or computer. You might have already noticed in this next update that we're doubling the amount of universes that you can record and play back to in the S-Play. This all works in the same way that you used to, but instead of 16 universes, you have 32 universes letting you get even more value out of your S-Play. That's it for today. Stay tuned for more updates. Thanks for watching.